Morning traders. Well, APAC equities have taken a dip uh, this morning following the lead from Wall Street where big tech led losses um, in Tuesday session there. Apple being the big loser after a downgrade from Barclays uh, over concern about iPhone demand. Uh, yields in the US dollar ripped higher. Uh, US dollar index having its biggest day since March 2023. Crude oil also had an interesting session, um, having a real roller coaster ride there. But let's have a look at the Apple. Uh, Apple stock fell around 3.6% during Tuesday's uh, New York session. Worst day since August, really. The um, the dump came after the uh, a downgrade from Barclays uh, with concerns about uh, slowing iPhone sales, particularly in China. I saw the stock gap down and erased all of December's gains with that gap, uh, hitting a low of 183.89 for finding some bids and, and rebounding modestly. Uh, the US dollar index uh, surged first day of trading of 2024, uh, having its biggest update update since uh, March 2023. There was little in the way of news flow behind the move, but really a result of a, a big jump in yields and some oversold technicals uh, that I guess were amplified by that low volume, um, still at holiday low volume trading. Um, DXY retook that 200-day simple moving average and the 102 handle, hit a high of 102.22. So the next um, test of the upside is really that resistance there at 102.57. Now crude oil, probably the most interesting market of the day, uh, initially surging in an uh, APAC session amid some growing Middle East tensions, only to really dump at the start of the US session with no obvious catalyst. Uh, probably some souring of risk sentiment and a stronger US dollar seem to be the only drivers there. So uh, USO USD finished the session just above $70 US a barrel with that um, big major support there at 67, the, really the next uh, support of any um, importance to the downside.